Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will look at how to create a store procedure. So, you can create store procedure to basically do any kind of operation that you want. For example, you need to delete the old records, then you can go ahead and write a store procedure. If you need to update a record, again you can write a store procedure. You can also use store procedure to basically select records for your data. The syntax for creating a store procedure is very simple, very similar to others that you have seen. So create procedure, procedure name and then you can also pass in a parameter that uh, basically you pass in when you are executing the store procedure and then you can also say what is the return type. So you can basically uh, return anything, for example, an integer or a table, anything that a store procedure could return. And within the begin and end statements, you basically pass in the statement list. And your statements inside a store procedure can be any statement except create and drop function, create and drop procedure. That is basically to say that you cannot nest a store procedure. So, we will look at a demo. To create a store procedure, I already have the code written with me. So, again, I am executing in the context of the sales database and I am creating a procedure called SP get data, which basically takes in a string and this string passes in the location of a particular file within the data lake store. So instead of querying from a table or a view, I am making use of a file within the data lake store and the path of the file is sent when this particular store procedure is executed. So within that file, the entire data is retrieved and the data is retrieved and stored within the add data variable. And what I am doing is, I am taking the same data and appending it to the table that we had created earlier. Okay. So review the job and just give the job name as store procedure and submit the job. So the job is successful. And if you go and check within your USQL catalog, you note that there is a store procedure that has been created over here. Thank you.